Hello dear friends, hope all are doing well. I am pleased to introduce the add-on course titled Academic Typesetting Using LaTeX hosted by the Department of Computer Applications, FISAT. On behalf of FISAT, I am Dr. Nishad Ye. For some time, I have been drawing your attention to the typical world of academic typesetting, LaTeX. LaTeX is a typesetting system and in today's academic world, it is a de facto standard for high quality document typesetting. The most commonly used word processing software we use such as Microsoft Word and LibreOffice Suite all are general purpose rich text editors. Comparing LaTeX with these VCVIC kind of typesetting tools there are many advantages to this. Yes, VCVIC. That is the word I use now, right? Once you join this course, you will come to know what is VCVIC and some other terms. Of course, Microsoft has a simple interface for ordinary users. A straightforward and self-explainable operating procedure. And a shallow learning curve. Yeah, all these are correct. But... Using general purpose tool like Microsoft Word for a specific purpose application like academic publishing is not entirely appropriate in these days. There are a bunch of reasons why LaTeX is better than MS Word for research writing. First of all, it prints, LaTeX prints wonderful looking documents and is very elegant. Then. LaTeX is free and unlike Word or LibreOffice, it is completely machine independent. Repetitive work like indexing, table of contents creation, all these are done automatically by your LaTeX system. Then management of cross references and bibliographic references are very much easier in LaTeX system. And the main highlight LaTeX typesets match beautifully and much more easily than Word or LibreOffice. Or in cloud environment, we have Google Doc and all. The modularity it provides with structuring the document, equations, citations, etc. help you create a professional quality paper that appears ready for submission. LaTeX still is the main tool for writing academic text and it will be for a long time. There are different concepts, tech, LaTeX, etc. Tech and LaTeX are not the same. Tech is a computational typography language or a system developed by Donald Knuth in the 70s. It is the backend for the typesetting language designed by Leslie Lambert in 80s for easy producing documents with tech. The scientific publishing industry has built a stable infrastructure around LaTeX now. So, as a science student who wants to trade in the academic world, it is essential to know this tool. It's very easy too. LaTeX does have a steep learning curve, especially for people from life science. LaTeX is far easier for researchers in computer science and related fields as they are familiar with similar Mac markups. Coming to this course, here in this course, we will get to know about the basics of documentation using LaTeX. So these are some of the learning objectives of this add-on course. In the introduction part, uh, we will look into the history and what are the advantage of LaTeX documentation system compared to the traditional uh, documentation software tools. Then we will understand about the structure of the LaTeX document, basic commands, uh, environment setup and uh, there are some online tools for all these things and how to set up our system for developing LaTeX source. All these things will be discussed. Then simple typesetting commands, page layout, page layout, decorations of heading, page numbering, layout, then different uh, documentation, different parts of document, chapter, sections, uh, then important points like bibliography, 
creating bibliographic database all those things will be discussed here and of course tables generation generating table of contents indexes making list uh, type setting equations type uh, creation of algorithms creating bibliography using different packages table of contents index glossary and uh, list of figures in how to insert floating elements like figures tables etc making algorithms and we will also uh, familiarize about uh, some of the packages like ticks and how to incorporate your geogebra with uh, latex all those things will be explored in this add-on course so uh, once again i invite everyone to this add-on course thank you